Since becoming Prime Minister, Keir Starmer has exerted tight control over the Labour Party and the UK government. One of his most controversial moves has been the proposed cuts to winter fuel payments for millions of pensioners. This decision sparked significant discontent among Labour MPs, many of whom urged Starmer to reconsider. However, he remained firm on his stance, ignoring the concerns of his colleagues. In a new twist, an insider has revealed that Starmer is planning to remove a key cabinet member from his government. Speculation surrounds Transport Secretary Louise Hay, who made headlines earlier this month for her sharp criticism of P&O ferries. Hay's comments reportedly jeopardized a £1 billion investment from the company, which led to significant frustration within Starmer's government. A senior minister commented on the situation, stating, If there were a reshuffle tomorrow, I believe she would be out. The Prime Minister was not pleased with how the P&O situation was handled. This suggests that Hay may soon be ousted from her role as Transport Secretary. However, the issue doesn't stop there. Deputy Leader Angela Rayner also voiced criticism of P&O ferries, raising questions about her future in Starmer's cabinet. Rayner and Starmer have had a tense relationship over the past three years, with Starmer allegedly attempting to oust her from the Labour Party back in 2021. Even after becoming Prime Minister, Starmer has kept his distance from Rayner, fueling speculation that she could be his next target in a future reshuffle. While Starmer's leadership has been marked by decisive action, his authoritarian approach could backfire. Continued friction within the party and unpopular policies may lead to public outrage, potentially destabilizing both his government and the Labour Party. Do you think Keir Starmer is behaving like a dictator? Share your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to like this video if you agree.